World building is an essential part of any anime for me. Setting up a world of imagination and creativity works wonders in getting an audience invested in a series. So that time I got reincarnated as a slime. The best isekai with the stupidest name. As the title implies, a man is reincarnated as a slime and proceeds to change the new world that it finds itself inhabiting. What I enjoyed about this series was its lore and history that the world has, such as the Sundere dragon or goblins. Small moments like that in the dwarven city just adds to the story while making it feel natural and real. Beyond that, the rules and powers of the world like naming magic when the characters are given a name as a buff. Not just that, but the history of the world with how the characters are introduced such as the before-mentioned dragon and how that event changes the world like a domino effect. History is important to a series to set up not only the world but the character cast as well. It's simple yet effective and that's what I like about it. As I've said before, character designs are stories in their own right. Just how a character looks can tell a whole book about them, their personal personality and more. Look at Rimuru who goes from being a slime to a female form. Not just it but the other characters who have excellent designs as well as unique weapons and personalities. It's just fun to watch these characters live their lives and I can't wait to see more in the future as one of the best isekais of the decade. If you like this video please give it a like, subscribe and hit that notification button for more content from yours truly. Also follow me on Twitter for the link in the description. Cheers for watching. Also Shion and Milim are best girls.